All right, so with that being said, the finals have been uh, kind of a snooze based on the first two games out in Golden State, unless you're rooting for the Warriors. Uh, what's the question here? Have the finals been uh, disappointing through the first couple games here? Absolutely, and that question was courtesy of Tim in Bristol. Thank okay. you for the submission, Tim. Absolutely. When you talk about generational players in LeBron James and Steph Curry, you're expecting the heavyweight fight, the Ali Frazier, the bird magic, and it just hasn't amounted to that. Especially with OKC, with, uh, with Golden State beating OKC, you're like, all right, this is setting up a prime time matchup. And because last year, because they didn't have Kevin Love and Kyrie Irving, and I know Love has been hurt in this series too, we thought this would be the series we've been waiting for after last year was kind of the appetizer to it all without a full Cavaliers roster. So a huge disappointment. When you talk about games one and two, um, double digit spreads in that, I mean, people who are trying to stay up, they're turning the TV off. The, the worst part about what's going on right now in the finals, and yes, of course, it's a disappointment, but the worst part is, and we talked about this, the NBA playoffs overall are so predictable, you have to make up for it with a great conference mm -hmm. final and finals. How many in the entire NBA playoffs, how many good series have there really been? The OKC and San Golden San State one, yeah. and then maybe OKC and San Antonio, you could argue that was back and forth and then OKC won three straight or whatever it was. So maybe, you know, one and a quart, one and three fourths of a series was really compelling. The rest has been an absolute dud. Now it's great. I love watching Steph Curry, no matter if he's dominating or whatever. Uh, if the games aren't close, if he's hitting, hitting shots, I'm right. in. But yeah, it's been a huge disappointment, especially LeBron's one of the best players ever. Right. You gotta be more competitive. You don't have to win, you gotta be more competitive. It's almost, it's almost like the AFC Championship game this year. Brady, Manning, 17, the last stand, and that game wasn't very good. No, it was terrible. I mean, it was, it, was, it was competitive, but it wasn't. The quarterback play the in that quarterback game play was wasn't great. underwhelming. We always just bring it back to Tom Brady and the Patriots, don't we? Well, that's a, there are uh, foundations.